If you've got a Fire Stick or other Fire TV device, you've probably already discovered a helpful app called Downloader, which you can use to install apps you can't find on the Amazon App Store. If you haven't yet discovered Downloader, you are missing out on tons more apps. And in this video, I'll show you the only Downloader code you'll need. Let's go and take a look. Before we start, a quick reminder that a VPN is another essential app for your Fire Stick if you want to unlock its full streaming potential. Atlas VPN is a great choice and unblocking geo-restricted content is a great example of how it can benefit you. If you live in the US, you can collect Atlas VPN to a UK server and watch Netflix content from the UK library and vice versa. Just be aware that some apps are available in certain areas only. For example, the ABC app can only be used by viewers in the US. But with a VPN such as Atlas VPN, you can trick your internet into thinking that you are in the US so that you can enjoy the content from the ABC app no matter where you are. Check out the link in the description or pinned comment below to get Atlas VPN for just $1.83 a month plus three extra months for free. If you haven't already got the Downloader app, let's quickly install it from the Amazon App Store. From the home screen, choose the Find option, then click on Search. Use your remote to start typing in the word Downloader and you'll see it pop up underneath the on-screen keyboard. Click on Downloader, then click the orange Downloader app. On the next screen, click the button to get or download the app. Then when it's finished installing, click open and then click allow. Otherwise you'll get errors when using Downloader and you won't be able to save files to your device. If you have a newer Fire Stick or Fire TV where the developer options menu is hidden, when you get to the My Fire TV settings, select About. Next, tap the Select button on your remote seven times or until you see a message at the bottom of the screen that says, no need, you are already a developer. Once that message appears, press the Back button on your remote once and you'll now be able to see and access the Developer Options menu and allow Downloader to install unknown apps. You can use Downloader to visit web pages and sideload apps onto your Fire Stick, such as my Downloads page, and you can access it by entering one short and simple code. Open Downloader and type in 28907, then click Go. and wait a few seconds for the page to load. Tap down the screen to view a list of categories for movie and TV show apps, live TV and sports apps, news and more. This downloads page has over 400 apps, so make sure you add it to your favorites. That way you can keep returning to it to install even more great apps on your Fire Stick. To add it to your favourites, press the Options button on your remote, then select Add Current Page to Favourites. A name for the page is automatically generated, but if you want to change it, tap on the name, then click Clear and change it to whatever you want. Then click Next and click Done. Now, you don't even need to remember the short code to get to my Downloads page. Just open Downloader and tap over to the left to select Favourites, then tap across to the link to open it. You might find it easier to view the Downloads page in full screen mode, and to do that, all you need to do is press the Options button twice on your remote. 
Now select a category, then you'll see a list of apps. Find an app you want to install and select it. Then on the next page, you'll find more information about the app with links to a tutorial if needed and a blue download button that looks like this. Select the button and install the app. Now when the app is installed, make sure to click done, then click delete and delete again to delete the installation file as it's no longer required and it will just take up space on your Fire Stick. You can now go into your app screen and open your newly installed apps. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, comment and subscribe to my channel, making sure that you turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my latest releases. These small actions from you make a big difference to me and helps to improve how YouTube recommends my videos to potential subscribers. And I truly appreciate your help in making my channel grow.